In this video, I'm going to show you how to add admin game passes to your Roblox games in Roblox Studio. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to go ahead and add HT admin in the toolbox. You can go ahead and search it up or find it. And it's going to say it's going to include scripts. Press OK. And then you want to go ahead and hide this little pop up thing for HT admin. It's the icons. Let's put it under the base play if you want to. And after you do that, you want to go to view and just make sure you have explorer properties and uh, toolbox opens. This normally has those tabs open. It's really useful. Then go to explorer, go to HT admin, go to the settings in there. Go ahead and double click on it. It's the settings script which is going to take us to add in our game pass stuff and you can see the script here and you can see game passes under ranks and you can see there is a id we can put in so go ahead and go to the create tab go to the creator dashboard okay and once you get here you want to go ahead and go to creator if it's a group game you want to go ahead and change the creator which i'm going to go to super fans go to there and then i'm going to go ahead and go to my game which i'm using the game that i did for the 40 percent method which is this makes it easier so you want to go ahead and go to the game that you want to add the admin game pass in go ahead and press the three dots and go to create badge now it's going to redirect you to the game stuff and you want to go to the associated items section which is on the left side as you can see here in associated items go to passes which is short for game pass go ahead and create a pass you want to go ahead and normally put in like the icon of the admin like hd admin or holes admin you want to do that for the picture so they get the idea i'm going to type in hd admin for this uh, game pass name then do a little description just explaining what it is find this game pass gives you permission to use hd admin commands while in game and then go ahead and create game pass and then there it is created and uh yeah it's really easy to do and then you want to go ahead and press three dots copy asset id which is the game pass id go back to the game and enter in the game pass id and then we go ahead and like backspace this and put it in correctly and then we're going to change this to admins so they actually have admin which is a little above vip you can type that in and it has the game pass id and the admin so they're going to get that rank when they buy the game pass from your game go ahead and close that sussy baka and then we're going to go ahead and do cole's admin as well this is to show you the difference in the script so it's just search up cole's admin in the toolbox and you just click it and then press ok for adding the scripts in game and then hide the calls admin icon thing then you want to go ahead and go into explorer and open up the model you can delete the thumbnail camera you don't need that and you go to credit go to settings and within here you want to go ahead and scroll down on the script and it's going to be a little lower than you know the hd admin script so down here you're going to see the vip admin which is basically game pass for admin so yeah uh right here it's actually going to explain a little bit you can set multiple assets to grant users admin powers so it can be different ranks if you want to for certain game passes but we're only going to do one game pass which is for the admin rank so we're gonna go ahead and just type this in just copy what i do so i'm gonna do a certain bracket thing i think they're called brackets and uh, it actually gives you a prompt about how to make them like in the upper area which you can see uh but anyways you want to do three which is the number of the admin rank number three is admin and then right here we're going to enter in the game pass id go ahead and go back here and go three dots and copy s id you get the idea that it's going to be from the game pass we don't have to make a separate one just for this one but you just get the main idea and then we're going to go ahead and backspace this and put it back where it should be then you can go ahead and close that and then that will save and then you can just close it and we're going to test it in game now it's going to say for cole's admin and hd admin that i'm a game creator so it's not gonna do what it's normally supposed to do it says i own the game pass of course but it just says i'm an owner because i made the game make sure to go ahead and smash the like button and subscribe to the channel if you found this video helpful and you appreciate this this is how you add admin game passes to your roblox games and if you want to learn how to give everyone free admin for your roblox games as well go ahead and click the one video that's showing up on the screen now